Hello everybody, this is Baljee from JK, welcome on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show how you can uh, install Windows 10 64-bit from bootable USB drive. In my last video, we have learned how you can download Windows 10 64-bit for free and create bootable CD or USB drive or bootable DVD or USB drive. In this video, we will gonna install Windows 10. If you haven't watched my that video, I will leave a link in description so you can uh, watch how you can download Windows 10 for free and create either a DVD or bootable USB drive. So in this video, I'm gonna go through step by step how you can uh, bring your system to boot from the, the USB drive. Also, if you want to uh, partition your uh, hard drive or you wanna uh, like format your, your uh, hard drive so we're gonna start installing and we're gonna connect this USB drive to your PC on the USB port anywhere you have on the front or back whatever you can uh, you can just connect it and then we're gonna start I'm gonna bring my camera I'm gonna bring the camera a little bit closer so we can just focus on uh, on the screen, uh, the the process. Let's... Okay, now we connected a USB drive to our PC and we're gonna turn the PC on. I have a Lenovo, so depend on the PC. You're gonna press one of the keys you can uh, get in the wireless settings. And my uh, PC, I'm gonna press F1. I have a done already uh, bootable uh, I have a pick the USB drive but I'm gonna show how you can go here so from here we're gonna go to startup like over here we're gonna do the primary boot sequence press the enter over here I have a USB key so I have a connected USB key one scan disk whatever so but if you wanna move any other one you're gonna bring uh, the, the arrow and you can press plus and minus sign and it will bring so over here we done we have a USB bootable device the first primary so what we are gonna do we are gonna go back we are gonna save and exit so we are gonna say just yes, enter as soon as we start it this uh, PC will uh, start booting from the USB drive Now we have no, uh, uh, we don't need to any press any key. It gonna pick up uh, this uh, USB automatically as a bootable. Or window gonna be uh, start installing. And I'm gonna pick the hard drive or any window you have uh, previously. So it will pick from the USB drive. And start up because it's taking from the bootable USB. It take a little longer. So in this video, what I'm gonna do bef I'm, uh, before I start, I'm gonna uh, just explain like it's gonna take a long time. So we don't have a time to be uh, watch the long video. So I will uh, skip forward some of the step, uh, some of the the process. So here, so we have to pick up the language if you wanna change, up to you. But uh, I don't worry about it. I'm gonna click on uh, next. Say I install window. Install now. Setup is starting. Over here, you're asking for accept the license and term. You can read if you want, but you have to accept. Then click on next. Here, if you wanna upgrade, then you can click on top. If you're gonna install new window, so we're gonna click on the bottom, custom, click on the bottom. Over here, as you can see, I have already a couple partitions. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring a are we gonna delete all the partition and we're gonna create new if you want to do create new partition then you have to delete the old one I'm gonna click delete okay I'm gonna delete this one delete it I'm gonna delete this one too okay so now here you can see it says a uh, unlocated space so we're gonna create new partition so to do that one we're gonna click on a new over here it shows total space and MB as we know 1 GB equal to 1024 MB so this one total so I'm gonna I'm gonna partition only two so I'm gonna bring in a half like say 200,000 MB it will be close to 200 GB 
apply okay we have a create one already and this one is system reserved we can do nothing about it and now this one also unlocated if you want to create another one you can create click new you can uh, do whatever size you want but I'm gonna click this one the last one so I'm gonna say apply so now I got partition 2 partition 3 now here before you click on next you have to choose which one the partition you want to install window so I'm gonna install on window partition 2 the first one click next over here you're gonna take some time to process all the files you're gonna be uh, take about like maybe five to seven minutes depend on your uh, system speed okay now we have a hundred percent we have to be very careful at this time we need to do one thing out of two so as soon as this process is done you have to disconnect your USB drive or you have to go to back and system and uh, bring your uh, hard drive as a primary because if you leave it the USB drive connected as soon as this PC this uh, this uh, process gonna be finished your uh, PC gonna start uh, like it's gonna restart and it's gonna pick USB drive as a bootable device again and it's gonna keep going the same process it's gonna ask you to install window and it never gonna be finished so here's the window needs to restart to continues you can click to restart but before you do you can disconnect USB drive so I disconnected USB drive so now PC is gonna start and all the window files are a copy inside and it's gonna start installing from the hard drive if we have uh, connected this uh, USB it's gonna pick up from uh, the USB bootable and it's gonna ask you to the same process we have done already now we're gonna pick up one of the information like where you are located so i'm in the united state i'm gonna click on united state uh, yes uh, this is really important if you're living uh where you're living you have to uh pick up that's the area because that's gonna be your system time and date give is this is the right keyboard layout United kingdom so yes so do you want to add a second keyboard about layout you want to add you can add otherwise I'm gonna skip you can follow instruction according to your choice whatever you wanna do or whatever not so here is asking to be connect with one of the network uh, you can pick that's the mine I'm gonna say connect over here is asking for password so I'm gonna so after you add password, it's going to take some time to be connect. So it's connected already. I'm going to click on next. I'm going to click set up for personal use. You can use for organization or whatever. You're going to pick one next. So over here. Uh, sign in with Microsoft My, I don't have any so actually uh, I can do here offline account so you don't need to put any email or anything so I'm gonna say no so you can have a PC name I'm gonna have a JK B A L J I T J O H A L next I wanna keep any password so you can uh, have any password I can pick one you have to confirm for second time OK, 
Okay, now we're done. Our window is installed. So, here we go. We're ready to use our window. So now our window is ready. So we uh, are ready system, to use. We're gonna all click here. We're gonna all go the way bottom the about. And we're gonna click on system. It's gonna show us all the information and here. Spot. Uh, it's like a 64 bit operating system, and it has a Windows 10 Pro. Now you can enjoy your Windows 10 64 bit. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please like, share, comment. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.